Water. It's something we take for granted. There's a finite amount of water and we have to take care of it to make it last for generations in the future, way into the future. Lake Erie, the Detroit cutoffs, what's going on in our world? So I'm Rob Maniscalco and I'm going to do a Kickstarter campaign to create awareness of how important water is. I'm going to be going to Haiti and I'm going to create a body of work a series of oil paintings, 12 to 15 paintings that are going to express some of the struggles and some of how people have overcome this, this obstacle, getting fresh water, something that we shouldn't have to fight for. We're going to be doing a collaboration with Water Missions International, which is an organization that's invented and goes all over the world with a water filtration system so they can take sewage and turn it into fresh water to get it to people who are in need uh, in uh, outlying areas and in areas where there's been disasters, such as Haiti. This project will take place in Haiti. I'm going to be traveling to Haiti, uh, and that's what part of the money for the Kickstarter campaign is going to be to fund this trip uh, that I'm going to make uh, seven to ten days and I'm going to be there uh, teaching and working with Water Missions International. They'll be providing lodging and food. So I believe in the power of art and the power of art to uh, transform and to uh, convey uh, information and to inspire people to action. I came up with the idea of going to Haiti, taking photographs, interviewing people, getting background information, finding out, digging around, as part of the team of Water Mission International missionaries who are going there to, um, to bring water to the people. Um, we in our country take for granted, although not so much anymore with things going on the way they are, where people are struggling to have access to uh, water. The project, to me, is about um, bringing the people up and showing how people can, under any circumstances, uh, rise as I start to think about this project of, of uh, you know, people just bringing water with joy in their heart like the, the prototype for the exhibition. The painting I did of uh, Christelle who is a, a little girl in Haiti. It is an expression of survival as an expression of how you can uh, find happiness, find peace, find joy, even in a puddle of mud and under any circumstances how, how you can turn the world around and become that beacon of hope for others who also are struggling in any number of circumstances, rich and poor, uh, any ethnic or racial group, we're all struggling with something and uh, my work is about that struggle and how we find creative ways to make it possible to be happy. For me to, to share that on a large scale to uh, lots of people who would not have ever thought perhaps that water was some, even something to even think about. That access to things we take for granted, uh, if it doesn't involve me and my world, it's not on our radar. Well, we're going to bring it into the radar of a lot of people who are going to be seeing it and having a painting or a gicle or artist proof on their wall that says, I'm part of a project that is bringing hope and renewal and love and life to everyone. And that's what I do in my work and that's what Water Missions is doing in their work. So this work will be the main feature of the project. And if you bid $2,500, you'll get your first pick of paintings that will probably go somewhere between $2,500 and $8,000. So it's a really great way to get in on the ground level with uh, the purchase of a really fabulous piece of art. And of course, there'll be other levels for you to be participating in, including a signed catalog and invitations to the events. Take a look at uh, all the possible things that you can participate with because we 
work together, things happen. Thanks. Mm -hmm.